businesses and other human activities were brought to a halt. An escalation in typhoid and malaria cases have also been reported with health officials describing it as alarming. The cases keep on coming. There is uh, quite a number, a rising number of uh, cases that we have been seeing. In fact, lately we have had cases that have had uh, typhoid ileal perforations, which we've been able to do surgical uh, operations, interventions for them. Properties worth millions of CDs have been lost. Both the young and the aged are struggling to survive in the midst of the floods. Persons living with disability are not spared either. 73-year-old Kwame Alex is physically challenged and his home was inundated by the rising water. His family members have all moved to a safe haven provided by the Central Gonja District Assembly. But due to his condition, he could not immediately move with them. He's simply frustrated. It's coming all the time. So I don't know what to do now. Uh, no help, no proper help. Kwame who has been diagnosed of typhoid, is left with no hope as he struggles to buy his medication prescribed for him. Uh, as the water came, I went to hospital. They gave me medicines. I take everything. I'm done. But I have to go back there. No money to. I can't go. So I need serious help. With the water levels still increasing and livelihoods affected, thousands of residents, including the likes of Kwame, will continue to suffer the impact as food supplies are not forthcoming. Paramount Queen Mother of Bupe Bridge, Barki Sumankri says, the Bupe flood victims are not given the necessary attention. The world should look at Bupe. Bupe is dying. The people of Bupe are dying silently. Unfortunately, we are not being recognized. We are not being, being felt that we are part of uh, uh, the, 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 the flood prone areas. Paramount chief of the Bupe traditional area, Bupeura Abdullah Jinapur II, expressed worry over the level of devastation. There you can see almost the whole suburb, which is economic boom of Bupe, is out. It's cut off. Water has gone through the whole uh, houses there. And you know that place is a densely populated place. All the Bola areas, they've all been covered <laughs> by water. Well, I went there personally and advised them that they should, be, they should be boiling the water. But you know our people, some of them don't care. They say, 